So I am speaking of the cuff here um, as an attempt to explain what I'm doing with this work. Um, my main interest and my main focus is on misandry. And I don't expect most people to have heard the word misandry or have any knowledge of the concept of what it is about. Misandry, I suppose, is the equivalent of misogyny, where everyone seems to know about misogyny. So where misogyny is about the poor treatment of women in the society, misandry, misandry is the same type of description, but concerning the treatment of men in the society. So misandry is a description of the negative treatment of men in society. Um, the, prevalent, the prevalence and the enormity of the negative treatment of men in so many regards. I've addressed the different issues regarding the treatment of men in many videos under the man-woman myth label. I used to have a website um, manwomanmyth.com that has been taken down some time ago I imagine because of non-payment of fees to keep it available because I've had some troubles in life and it's taken me out of normal activities I've had medical, medical troubles so I am seeking to make a return to activity and uh, it is not easy and my contributions will be limited somewhat but I will try to make an effort um, I'll try to republish my old material which used to be available on the internet but um, has since been taken down so I'll try to make that available again and try and do some new work as well and I suppose this talk um, constitutes part of that return I think the issues that I addressed with the analysis of misandry are still relevant to today but my knowledge of the environment today for men is different and less than it was before so I, I imagine my analysis will be somewhat sketchy but um, I can't imagine that the things I'm thinking about are no longer relevant I'm sure there's still relevance in the things that I want to discuss so um, yes this channel on YouTube does concern the analysis of misandry and um, as a counterpoint to the analysis of misogyny and men don't seem to realize their position in society or have a proper appreciation of how they're treated in comparison to how women are treated and and how the life experiences of men are addressed or rather not addressed properly in in society so i'm seeking to shed light on the experiences of men and the conditions of men and um i hope it's of use to people out there